Hello and welcome back to the new video of the Java tutorial series. So today we will be covering access modifiers in Java. Uh, so there are two types of access modifiers in Java, access modifiers and non-access modifiers. And the access modifiers in Java specifies the access uh, scope of the field, method or constructor of the class. And we can change the access level of the fields, constructor methods and class by applying the access modifiers on it okay so there are mainly four types of access modifiers one is private a default protected and public so private defines the access level of the private modifiers is only within the class uh, and it cannot be accessed outside of the class and the default one is has the access level of the default modifiers only within the package and it cannot access from outside of the outside of the package if you do not specify any access level it will be the default okay uh, protected uh, for protected the access level of the protected uh, modifiers is within the package and outside the package through the child class if you do not make the child class it cannot be accessed outside the package and the public the public access level modifier is everywhere it can be accessed from the within the class outside the class within the package or the outside of the package so understanding of the java access modifiers let us understand by this simple table so the if the access modifier is private it can be ac accessed within the class but it cannot be accessed within the package uh, but it can and it also cannot be accessed outside the package by the subclass only and it it cannot be accessed outside the package also so this is the yes no yes no chart uh, this is the easiest one to understand uh, how the access modifiers are working inside the java okay so the first one is private for private i have taken one example over here you can see let me just uh, okay yes one class is there class a and which has the private uh, variable name as data and value to it is 40 and uh, one method is there private void message uh, which is printing hello java on the console and one public class simple uh, we have written the main method and we have created object of that class a and we are trying to print uh, obj.data and we are trying to execute that mess uh, method which is msg inside this uh, simple class which is public and by using the object of that class that is obj okay uh, whenever you write this this kind of statements uh, to access the da data which is private and which is un inside the another class you, you will get the compile time error uh, in both the lines because you are trying to access those data members which are private in privately declared inside the another class okay you cannot access these members okay so the role of the private constructor if you make a, any class constructor private you cannot create the instance of the class outside of the class okay for the for example here you can see uh, one class a is created and we have created one uh, constructor uh, which is private okay and one method uh, method is there msg which is printing hello java and inside our public class inside our main method we are trying to create the object of that class a obj is equal to new a and we'll we, here, 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 here itself, we will get the compile time error because the constructor which 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 is declared for the class A is private, and we cannot uh, access that constructor which is private, and that's why we cannot create the object of the class. Okay, so the role of the private constructor is if you make the class constructor private, you cannot create or instance of the class outside of that class. Okay. Uh, next up, we have default uh, default access specifier. Okay, so let me zoom in. Okay, uh, yes. Here, example, you can see one package is there, package pack, and one class is there uh, which holds one method, msg, and which is printing hello on the console. Okay, and inside uh, b dot java, uh, we are uh, in the different package. Uh, that package name is my pack, and we are trying to import all the classes which are defined in the pack pack package and to do do so we are writing one statement import pack dot star star represents all to import all the classes which are defined inside that package uh, in in that pack package we have uh, written one one class that is class a and inside our class b uh, we are inside our main method we are trying to create the object of that class a and that is obj and we are trying to access that msg method which is inside that pack packaged class name a uh, here itself we will get compile time error because the the 
definition of the default we have seen over here uh, the access level of the default modifiers is only within the package it cannot be accessed outside of the package okay and we are trying to access these uh, method uh, over here here you can see we are trying to access this msg method which is written written inside the pack package and we are trying to access it inside the my pack package this is not possible in java and you here itself you will get you will get a compile time error okay uh, now for the protected one uh, this is the example same package name pack and same class name uh, but the method which we have declared over here is uh, declared as a protected method and we are trying to print, print hello on the console okay and inside the another package my pack we are trying to import all the classes uh, which is written inside the pack package and class b extends class a because we are trying to inheriting inherit all the properties of which are written inside the class a and inside our main method we will, we will write the object uh, object of the class b b object uh, new b and we'll call obj dot msg and the output should be hello which is getting printed and for the definition of the protected we have seen the access level per access level of the protected modifies is within the package and outside the package throughout the child class if you if you create the child class you can access it outside the package now for the public one uh, we will write one package pack and class a uh, which is holding one method msg and which is printing hello and in another package we will uh, try to import that uh, class which is written inside the pack package by writing import pack dot star and inside the class b inside the main method we will create one object of that class a and we will print simply call that method uh, obj dot msg and we will print uh, hello on the console why because for the public definition of the public uh, access modifier says that it can be accessed uh, from within the class outside the class within the package outside the package everywhere you can access that data members if you declare it as a private public okay so this is pretty much about the access modifiers in java we will see you in the next one video thank you